Where are you there? Okay, okay. If that's you, look at verse 66 and read it aloud. From that time, many of his disciples went back and walked no more was him. What did Jesus do? Did he repackage the message? Alter the message? Change it? Did he apologize to them? Hey, come back. Come back. Is it what I said? Is it what I preached? I pray the Lord will bless you today as you uh, have faith in the prayer of today. And uh, the prayer of today will give you testimony in Jesus' name. And at the end of this prayer section, you will be glad that you participated in that prayer. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Uh, briefly, this... Uh, Briefly, this morning or afternoon, we, we want to quickly consider a very uh, important uh, a very important topic that God has for us. And uh, this is our authority in Christ. This is our mandate. This is what God wants for us. In the book of Isaiah, chapter 61, verse 1. Book of Isaiah, chapter 61, verse 1. The Bible says, The Spirit of the Lord God is upon me, because the Lord has anointed me to bring good news to the afflicted. Because the Lord has anointed me to bring good news to the, to the afflicted. He has sent me to bind up the broken heart, to proclaim liberty to captives and freedom to prisoners. We are looking at liberation from captivity. People have been under captivity, different forms of captivity. When you talk of captivity, captivity is when you have ability, when you want to do something, but the ability to do it is not there. You you like something, you design something that yes, this will work well for me. But ability to carry that thing out is not there. That's captivity. You desire that you should be in good health. You desire that you should uh uh you should have children. Many desires in life, but you just discover that it's not there. No happiness, no cooperation, no progress, no moving forward. Now it is either this one today or that one tomorrow. That is captivity. But what God is assuring today is liberation. And you will be liberated in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 He said, the spirit of the Lord God is upon me. Hmm. The anointing of God is on me. Because the Lord himself has called me out, has anointed me to bring good news. Ah. I don't know what I've been bringing tears from your eyes. But the Lord has sent me today to bring you good news that that thing that brings tears in your eyes will turn to joy in your life in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, he Jesus. He has told me to bring good news to you. Amen. I don't care what you have been hearing from people. From people. And people will say, ah, no, it should be difficult. And people will say, it can be easy. And people will say, ah, you have to struggle and struggle and struggle. And people will say, oh, you have to pray for 21 days. You have to do this. You know, they, they, they solemnly bring an impossible task to you. Well, if you can achieve this one, then everything will be okay. But today, 
the Lord has sent me to bring good news to you and to tell mm -hmm. you that what is bringing limitation to your life we bring liberation to your life in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. He has anointed me to bring good news to the afflicted. He has sent me to bind up the broken added. And then you look at it, you say, I don't think there is hope. So I tell you that after this prayer, there will be hope. Thank you, in Jesus. In the name of Jesus, Amen. where there seems to be no way. You say, but people are moving like speed of light. This one has done, this one has done, this one has done. I'm telling you that your time to begin to move has come now. Thank you. And Jesus. it will happen to Amen. you and your family in the Amen. name of Jesus. Amen. He has sent me to bind up the broken heart and to proclaim liberty to the captive. Yes. That thing that says you cannot get it, you have desire. I want to be this, but ability is not there. I want to achieve this, ability is not there. I want God to just, 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 just make things easy for me. Uh, but ability to make it easy is not there. There is celebration today. You are coming out in the name of Jesus. Amen. And freedom to prisoners. When you say freedom to prisoners, He's not talking about people that have gone to steal and then they put them in the prison. He's not talking about those that are guiltless, but yet they condemn them to prison. He's not talking about those that are, 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 that are really guilty and they condemn them to prison and they say life imprisonment. We are not talking about that. When you talk about prison, we talk about spiritual prison. We talk about those that have been defrauded. And the enemy say, you will not pass beyond this bandit. And the enemy say, at so, 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 our uh, age, this is what calamity that would befall that family. And the enemy says that at, at such point, <laughs> there are some family, they say that once you have girls, this is what they will be going through. This is how life will be for them. Uh, but what we have come here to do is to liberate everyone. For whatever form of prison, prison of failure will disappear today. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. And so we want to go before the Lord. And I tell you, the prayer of tonight must be a prayer that we carry with. Amen. And one more time, if you are not close to God, or you have lost it one way or the other. Or uh, because of too many disappointments, you have lost hope in what God can do in your life. I tell you that this is the time now to reconcile yourself back. I tell you that this is the time that God wants you back. You mm -hmm. say, ah, he cannot do it, he cannot do it. But it's here to show you that he can do it. And so all you need today, and all you need this season is for you to go back to him and say, God, uh, because of too many things that have happened, I, I, I lost my confidence, I lost my trust in you, but now that I believe that you can do it, you are top, on, on top of my matter. I have come to seek for forgiveness, I have come to uh, seek for your assistance, somebody open your mouth and I can begin to pray. Jesus, I do, I will be the I've come to Lord, I've come to seek I am sorry. I need your mercy, Father. I am sorry for the I need your mercy over my life and oh God. I am very sorry for what I caught this morning. I said, Lord, why did you make me go through this? In the name Lord, of Jesus, why did you have of God, on me? Lord God of Lord, God, why is it that we call on you, but we are not getting anything? Way to seek I you, tell you that God is here now. In the name of Jesus. The Holy Spirit is here now. To do mighty things. To do greater things. In your life and in my life. I saw anything that wants to hold you to freedom. And anything that uh, Lord God of heaven, and also to see me go away today. Do me good, do good to my children in the name. And also we stand against your prayer. Oh, King of Glory, show me mercy. Oh, King of Glory, I tell you that your time.
time has come. In the See, your time has come. It depends on how you believe it. Your time has come. It depends on your faith. Your time has come. Do you believe that? If you believe that time and faith in the glory of the Lord, you are going to see the end of it. Judgment. Let your mercy prevail over every evil. Yes. Let your mercy prevail over every prison of the enemy. In the Jesus is always there. Yeah. It's yeah. never I mean, too late. That same God that created you for a purpose, He knows when you needed it in time. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, O Lord, I wish. O oh Lord, I honor you. O oh Lord, I glorify you. I give you glory. I give you honor. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Lord God, I In come. In Jesus' you. name we pray. Amen. Can I hear a congregation of amen? Amen. Today, we want to pray. We want to pray against sickness. We want to pray against diseases. These are spirits that put people in captivity. And then they begin to torment them with sickness. And then you just discover that, is it that this sickness does not have treatment? Remember that woman with the issue of blood? She has five from five boosters. She suffered from the hands of physician. She has gone to here, she has gone to there, looking for a solution, but no way out. As if God is not there. But this time I am. She said, if I may but touch the hem of his garment, I will be made whole." And true to him, because her faith was great. True to him, because she had confidence in Jesus. And so by the time she touched that hem, I tell you, sickness disappeared. The kind of hem you will touch today. We take away sickness from your life. Say amen. Amen. The end of touch. You will touch him today. We take away any form of ailment in your body. And henceforth, you will not spend your money on sickness. Somebody say amen. amen. I want you to open your mouth now and say, Lord, I touch you. Holy Spirit, I touch you. Heal me in my body. Heal me in Father, my spirit, Lord, in my soul. Heal me in my family. Lord. Lord, is somebody me, praying by for strap, I am here. Lord, oh, by God. the strap of Jesus, my children are here. Lord God, I, I need you to open your mouth and pray with me. I need you to marry hand of praise. Touch my children and I touch need you to pray with confidence in, in your heart. Remove every physical infirmity. Remove every, Lord, who non disease of us. Remove every disease of us. Remove every disease of us. Remove every disease of us. To any attack, to believe any believe you have Jesus in front of you now. God of heaven, believe and release your mercy. Heal my children, heal me for mercy in the name of Jesus believe Christ. Believe that today is my time. Oh God, mm -hmm. Papa, by the power in the blood today of is every my deposit of my enemy in the body of my enemy that we manifest in days to come to give in the name of Jesus. Lord in God, let me them me flash out now by the power in the blood of Jesus. Let them flash out. In the name of Jesus, Father, heal me, O Lord. Father, deliver me, O Lord, by the power in the blood. Set me free, set my children free. King of glory from any sicknesses, oh any Lord, I want you to Lord, me. bound every every sicknesses, every infirmities, every disease from the source of the Lord God, I want to be God I want to be my children of your power. from any sickness. In the name of Jesus, I am looking unto you, Jesus. The all people with complicated sickness, you heal them. I present myself to you today, Lord, heal me. Lune Paris pour mais elle a vie éternelle. Je lève les yeux vers toi, Jésus Christ, à la croix. Moi et mes enfants, apporte la guérison. Que tout ce qui est mari de Dieu venir déposer dans moi, dans mes enfants. Seigneur, que cela soit détruit dans le nom de Jésus Christ de Nazareth. Que tous les hommes et femmes sont en faire des invocations pour envoyer l'esprit de Dieu. Que ces hommes et ces femmes tombent dans le nom de Jésus. 
esprit de Nazareth, Père éternel des armées, tu chantais les temps venus sur le Que l'éternel des ferme toutes les portes à tous les Cache-moi et mes enfants dans le sang de Jésus. Que c'est un sacrifice d'avoir lieu. Seigneur, c'est ce qu'ils ont dépouillé pour me donner pour me donner maladie, pour donner attaquer mes finances, attaquer mes finances. Je suis marié à Jésus-Christ. 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 Je suis marié
he discovered that the new wife was practicing witchcraft. And so, uh, every attempt to go to the senior pastor and say, look at what is happening, well, uh, they said, well, in, uh, in, in our own Pentecostal, we don't, uh, we don't identify with you. Uh, we will leave them. We don't identify them. And so all we need to do is we continue in praying. But to say, uh, this one is a witch, no, 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 no. We, in our denomination, we, we, don't, we don't do that. And so the man has been in pain, and the man has been suffering, and the man has been going through a lot. I tell you a lot. See, whatever is bringing you pain today, we turn to gain for you. In Amen. the name of Jesus. Amen. Whatever is embarrassing Christianity in your life, the Holy Spirit will rise and fight for you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I want you to pray and tell the Lord, whatever is bringing pain in my life, whatever is causing me pain, whatever is making me to suffer, I command now in the name of Jesus, pack your Lord and go out. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and Jesus begin to pray. The way, Father, pack God, your Lord and go out. Lord of Jesus you Christ. have to leave. My life will come liberate the captive. I come to bring pain to my life, my children. Would giving me pain that be giving me pain? The and devil this pain is greater than whatever pain that can even bring. in my life, this pain is not what doctors can solve. The blood of Jesus in agreement with pain is not what human can solve. Live my life, live the life of my children. People are suffering. Pastor Nazareth, people are not happy. Yes, every invasion of their mandate, of their focus. Of a series of evil dreams, every attack opening. You cannot up. even focus. Lord, let of the pain. Them, me, How will you be going through pain and you will be pretending to yourself that everything is well? When you know that everything is not well. Par la foi de Jésus, tout homme, tout homme, tout esprit de mari de nous, tout homme qui pratique la sorcellerie contre moi et mes enfants. Oh my God! Those power, God. You must live your life. Wise. In the name of Jesus Christ. If you want to go through God pain again, power. So in people the are beginning to explain Christ hell, why on earth? Whatever that has been given to you, for your life, my children, making my life. God of heaven, has God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through pain. God has not called you to go through they have to come back again. There are the enemy of the the enemy of the enemy the enemy the enemy of 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 Put an end to the wickedness in the name of Jesus. The life of my children and my life in the name of Jesus. somebody to pray. Put an end, oh God. God oh, must show his power. The power to catch fire. God must heal you of that pain. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh Lord. He must heal you of that suffering. Pass on every programmation that has in been passed on. In the mighty name of Jesus. Program, oh Lord, to make life miserable for my children. Oh Lord, by the power in the name of Jesus, we command them to catch fire. We we all of mm. the evil decree. We reverse in them. In Jesus' we name, we pray. Amen. I pray that after this prayer, that thing that I've been bringing pain to you, the Holy Spirit will begin to attend to them now, and you will be free. You will be delivered in the name of Jesus. Amen. I need a louder amen. Amen. We want to pray. We want to pray against lack. We want to pray against poverty. These are one of the uh, uh, instruments the enemy uses to put children of God in captivity. When you you need something, but there is no source to get it. And, and you look at yourself, today I feel like taking fruit, but there is no money to purchase fruit. And you look at yourself and you say, ah, if I have money now, I will have done this, I will have done that. 
Do you know that if you have money, you will do the work of God better than the way you are doing it? Serving God will be much easier for you. And so, now that that thing is not be, it's not getting easier, it is very obvious that this is the handwork and the handwriting of the devil. You are going to pray and tell the Lord, Holy Spirit, take away poverty from my life. Take away poverty. Take away lack from my life. In the name of Jesus. You know, some people will look at you and say, yes, he did not have. And so because he did not have, they will carry clothes. Oh, yeah, take this clothes, you know. You don't know if it is a demonic clothes or not. Some people will package gifts. They will say, take this gift. Even if it is a demonic gift or not, you don't even know. So people will say, take this shoe. Yes, I know you do not have to. Take this shoe. Then once you wear it like that, you meet yourself in another place. You are going to tell the Lord, take away poverty. Poverty is the spirit. Let the spirit of poverty depart from my lining. Open your mouth and pray. Hallelujah, Father, in the name of Jesus. The poverty Amen. will no longer you exist in my family. For me to be rich, for me to be comfortable. Lord, poverty will no longer exist in my lineage. Take away poverty over my life. Take away poverty. In the name of Jesus. Take away poverty. Have a God poverty in my life.